Alright, this is a pneumatic directional valve. Today I'll just open it and see how it looks like from the inside. Now this is a coil. You can read it 24 volt DC or 2.2 ampere. Just open it. Now this part is your coil. And then just loosen those two screw. Inside there is a spring when you loosen these bolts be careful. Actually, what happened? <coughs> and this thing is connected there, and we supply the power. So it it is actually a normally is is pushing. It's a normal close. Now when we power it up, it will pull it back, and it will stay there. And as we let it go, the power out, it will come out and that I will just show you now and uh, <coughs> there yeah and you see there's a this diaphragm this diaphragm is pushing this uh, piston if I remove this piston See the inside must be a spring there. Just pull it out. There is the spring. Okay. That's a spring inside here. there is a supply and that is the output the supply and this is the output side <coughs> and then well that is the exhaust it's a blank this is also blank and this is the output Okay, and then I just want to show you <coughs> now there is a this plug okay that is 24 volts and uh, you see there is a resistor 24 volt to the resistor that is going to this LED and then the 0 volt. Okay, if I <coughs> okay, so and then I just have uh, this normally open contact, normally open switch. You will see now if I push it in, it's coming out. It's not staying there, but as I power it up, now the power is on. You will notice if I push it in, now it's staying in because inside there's a magnetic field now. And you will see now as I release this power, switch off the power, and that goes out. And uh, see now it's not, it, it cannot stay inside because there is no magnetic field inside. But as I supply a uh, 24 volt and I push it, in, <coughs> sorry, it just uh, winds out. Yeah. 
Oke. Okay. There we go. If I switch on the 24 volt, there it stays. Release, it goes out. And that's how it works.